Hey y'all, this is Casey from Pizzazz. I want to share with you today just a fun little project that you can either do with your kids or for your kids for this coming Valentine's Day. I was in a mom's group several years ago and we did this as a project and I loved it. What we did is we took a box and we decorated it and we filled it not with candy, but with encouraging words for our kids so that whenever they reached in and pulled something out, they could find something um, that said something about them. So here I have, these are from about three years ago, but you know, I love when you put on makeup just like mommy or let's see I love when you say what can I do to help you and you fill it with things that um, that you see in your child that you want to grow that you want to affirm them in because we know um, that words have power now this is a little bit you know this is fancy you don't have to even get this fancy you could use a mason jar and just put positive words in it but if you want to do it with a um, as a craft with your child um, an easy way is just to get a, a you know a blank box this I've already kind of started this but this was just a, um, a cardboard kind of box from um, like Hobby Lobby or Michaels you could even get a shoe box or a Kleenex box anything and my favorite way to do it is just to get scrap paper and Mod Podge and we just take foam brush and you put the Mod Podge under it and then over it and then it's done and that's what you can do you know you and your child can do that part together and then you um, fill it with just positive words so this is not hard if you've never used Mod Podge don't be intimidated you really just put it on stick on your paper put it on top and it'll look really gluey but then it will dry um, it'll dry clear so just have fun um, decorating a box and then you don't even have to cut out you know heart shapes you can just cut out slips of paper and write things on there I love how you skip everywhere you go and what's cool about this is that you don't have to all do it yourself you can get um, your husband to write a few things on there uh, grandma aunts uncles friends write things that they see in your child um, that can just build them up because um, once again words have so much power and this is something Something that can last and last way past Valentine's Day. My little girl, even before she could read, would pull these out and I would read them to her and she would have them memorized. And that's what we want. We want these kids to have those words really in their heart, memorized on their heart about the things that make them uniquely them and uniquely special. So um, find your calendar and write it down because this will not happen before Valentine's Day if you don't put it in your schedule. So um, just find your calendar, put a, a block of time in there just to either do it for your kids or do it with your kids. But um, I hope y'all love this project as much as I do. It's been a blessing for us. So y'all have fun.